very beautiful thing, and I, I want to acknowledge the fact Sorry. that we're not here to fight against the wider Australian community. We're here to fight with you. We're here to offer you your freedom. Freedom from this colonialist government and the ties to Mother Britain. Give you strength and let you be part of a story that is the first song of humankind, of the oldest culture in human existence. We offer that hand to you to learn knowledge. We offer you the hand to be part of it, to be part of our society and to love this land like we do and know a bliss that we have known for eons. We can show you the way to your freedom. We just need you to stand beside us. We're not looking for a hand up, we're offering it to you. We're, he we're here to fight for everyone and to make sure our song is still told. Don't deny your own power and know that you are all law people now. You contain an element of the story and it is your job to pass on that story. We'll, we all have the power. We all have the knowledge and we're willing to share it. Make sure you bring the voice of the people here back to your communities. Let them know what's going on and search for the answers. The answers aren't easy. They're hidden. Our entire history in this country has been hidden from us and it is all of ours to reclaim. Our history isn't that building that stands behind us. It's the land beneath our feet. Know it, love it, and stand strong. On that note, I think we're wrapping up. We'll start making our wander back to the tent embassy. I want you all to know the tent embassy's back in business. I, along with a collection of other youths and other supporters, have been given the green light to rebuild the embassy. Sadly, we're in the exact same position we were 43 years ago. No representation, no respect, no consent. We're here to fashion the spear of the embassy sharp again. Sharp out of knowledge, truth and love. And because we're fighting with those weapons, we're going to win. So let's go get a feed, eh? <laughs>